Hey everybody, uh, my name is Al Pills and I work for the Kettle House Brewing Company and I'm here today to talk a little bit about the Kettle House uh, and a little bit about two of our more popular beers, uh, Cold Smoke Scotch Ale and Double Hall IPA. Uh, the Kettle House has been around for just over 15 years and we try to make a beer that matches the quality of life in Montana, aka how good it is to be a Montanan. You know, we have all these great opportunities to recreate. We figured we ought to make a beer that matches up with some of those great opportunities. Um, we sort of do an outdoor themed uh, line of beers. Uh, Double Hall IPA obviously refers to a fly fishing cast and Cold Smoke was a, a ski in reference back from Tim O'Leary, our founder's days at Bridger Bowl. Um, Cold Smoke Scotch Ale, the first beer we're going to talk about is our flagship beer. It is a very approachable Scotch Ale. Um, it's a beer that to coin a phrase from one of our servers in uh, Big Sky, he said, uh, Cold Smoke Scotch Ale makes light beer drinkers into dark beer lovers. And uh, I feel like that's a great way to explain that beer. It's a great sort of a, a great foothold in the big doorway uh, known as craft beer. Uh, so for a little bit more on the technical end, I will hand it over to Paul, our head brewer, and uh, take it away. Cold Smoke is our beer. It's our passion. And it's really what's made this all come together. Uh, uses some sweet car caramel malts, balanced with roasted barley and black malt, and a little bit of brown sugar for some sweetness, and uh, golden tops to really round it out. Won bronze at the GABF in 2009, and has won at the North American Brew Fest as well, a couple years running. And uh, it's really just what's made it all happen for us. It's allowed us to open a new production facility, expand, put more packages and more package options. And really get those out there. Uh, it's also opened up some creative avenues for Southside Myrtle Street location. We get to brew uh, some great beers over the years. I think we did 30 to 40 last year. We've got a barrel aging program now, and it's uh, really allowed us to get specialty beers on tap in places like this right now.